to rotate pictures in the example gallery in Windows 7. The first thing you'll be asked to do is to open the folder. The example gallery is a zipped file. So first, extract all the f files in the function bar at the top of the file list. At that time, you're going to be asked where to put it. Typically, I put things that I've downloaded from the Internet on the desktop. It lets me delete them easily afterwards. Okay. Now I'm on my desktop. I am searching for the original gallery rotate and resize. And I've already gotten some thumbnails. If I don't see these as thumbnails, my view function is uh, below the search bar in Windows 7. And it uh, lets me go to extra large icons or large icons or medium icons. And that's my option. I'll go to extra large just for you. And now I've been asked to rotate. If I right click on the picture that needs to be rotated, I can rotate clockwise or counterclockwise. Let's take a look. I want this to go counterclockwise. So let's choose counterclockwise. And I get a little hint that I've done it right. So this is the first step. Here's another one. This again needs to be rotated counterclockwise. If you need to flip a picture 180 degrees, you'll simply have to rotate it twice. And that concludes rotating pictures inside of Windows 7.